<laughs> it is me, Brida Boom Boom. Of course, Charlie Karume has come to help me today with what I was shooting. Charlie, carry on. What I was saying is, when you're giving birth, yeah, <laughs> you have to make sure you just spread in this way. Yo, my dudes, take it. This behind me is a mirror. The camera in front of me does not have one. This is the Canon M50 mirrorless camera, and it's time for the takeover. So yeah, the Canon M50, it's part of Canon's brand new line of mirrorless cameras that I had the honor to sample like first in Kenya. I went for their soft launch last week and I was supposed to do like this whole unboxing, but I legit like got this off of the stand at the launch. It's because I was traveling to energy the next day. So yeah, I just plucked it off of the table and this is all I got. I basically got everything you get without the box. So this is it. You have your Canon M50 with the kit lens, that's a 15 to 45. You have the tiny battery, LPE12. You have the battery charger, and that's it. Apart from that, you get the manuals, but we don't have the manuals, clearly. But yeah, that's, that's the unboxing, yay! Now, if you still don't know what a mirrorless camera is, that means you missed my last episode where I went in on the differences between a mirrorless and a mirrored camera. The link is in the description, but I know you guys are lazy bastards. So let me just explain it for you. All cameras are basically the same. They take photos the same way. Light goes through the lens and hits a sensor and that info is translated into an image. But now DSLR, so that's, those are the big Nikons and Canons and Nikons? those those potato potato digital single lens reflex cameras they work by light going through a lens and then hitting a little mirror just before the sensor so it goes up and then you see the image on your viewfinder so that you're able to see the image so when you click on the shutter that little mirror flips up does the sound and then light hits the sensor and you have your photo but now how mirrorless cameras work they take away that whole need of having the mirror because their viewfinder is electronic so if you check out the m50 you will see no mirror in it so yeah, let's look at this mirrorless camera in particular and let's start with the lens it has a stock lens 15 to 45 this is the one that comes in the box when you buy it it goes all the way to f 3.5 which is not bad you can still get that nice blurred background on photographs this is an efm lens if you have the normal ef lenses and you're wondering no oh, will i have to buy a whole new set of lenses no or not you can get an adapter it's called an EFM adapter you can get that and then you can use all your favorite Canon lenses on this small bodied M50 so yeah behind that is the sensor it is the APS C kind of sensor. It's the same that you find in a Canon 7D Mark II or a Nikon D500. All factors constant, a bigger sensor means better photographs. So this is a pretty big sensor. It's perfect for all your photographs, especially those that happen to be in low light. So yeah, let's, let's cover. By the way, never open up your camera like this. I'm just doing this because I'm hoping Canon won't see me mistreating their camera online. Okay, all around it has this nice rubber that is super grippy you always want something that has a nice grip when you hold it you have your normal shutter button over here spinning dial dedicated record button multi-function button mode switcher on and off behind this flap you have your hdmi out over here mini hdmi out and then you have the usb mini usb there you have your wi-fi button because this camera has wi-fi yeah hey. Beneath that, you have the place where you put your battery. Boom, battery is in. Boom, your card is in. You're good to go. Bam, you have your mic input here, which is really important. Like something about small cameras, sometimes they don't have mic inputs. And then if the if you really want good professional sound, you can't get it. This one sorts you out. It has a mic input. Yes, yes. <laughs> And what else? You have your flash over here under that. And if you flip this here, you will find what Canon believe to be a vlogger's best friend, the swivel screen. 
Look at it swivel 90 degrees that way, a full ka 180 there. And it's perfect by the way for vloggers. Let's say you have your camera on, you're walking through the streets of Nairobi or whatever, and then you just you just need to record yourself. You go like, hey, this is me. I'm vlogging on my camera. I can see exactly where I am on the screen because the screen is right there next to me and it's touch as well. So if you want to focus on something else, yeah, focus on this beautiful face. And then also if you want to do shots from different angles, in case you want to get a super high angle that you're too short to get or if you want to do like a low angle you just tilt the screen the other way then of course you have the dual pixel auto focus it's ultra quick like this and also it gives way to the rise of eye tracking autofocus if you're a photographer if you've ever taken video it's all about the focus in the eyes do you see that that's the camera sensing exactly where my eye is so if i move around it just follows my eye another cool feature this camera can go up to 10 frames per second in images that's super quick it sounds like a machine gun excuse me super fast this camera can shoot video at full hd that's 1080p at 60 frames per second or 30 frames per second or 24 frames per second 4k at 24 frames per second and if you want to get that super slow mo you can shoot 120 frames per second at 720p that super slow mo and you can do it in camera you don't have to take the video and then go slow it down in your editing app you can actually do it in camera okay final cool feature i want to show you is the wire wireless connectivity this camera has Wi-Fi NFC and Bluetooth you just take your phone just tap it it links to your phone via Wi-Fi and through this app the Canon companion app you can take photos you can download photos directly to your phone you can remotely control your camera so that's me I just want to take a photo of that camera that's recording me boom it's taking a photo so as you can see the eos m50 is a super capable little camera but all that being said there are butts and you know how much i like big butts and i cannot lie so Eddie, what are the butts the things that i don't like about the eos m50 first thing the battery life is Horrid. So if you're buying it, make sure you buy two or three extra batteries. The more you make a camera smaller, that means the battery also has to be smaller. And honestly, you can't expect much from this tiny little battery. Also, when you make the camera smaller, that means there are going to be less and less buttons on it. What this means is that most of the functions have been put into menus, into other menus. Let's take a basic thing like changing from autofocus to manual focus. You have to go into menu, you have to go into like menu number what? There we go this is menu number four in a menu that's inside another menu come on it should be it really should be a switch guys another problem with it is that the grip is a bit too small for my liking i'm used to like bigger dslrs where my hand like properly grips the grip but this one is a bit smaller i end up like clutching it like this in a weird hand formation that honestly just reminds me of like someone dancing to michael jackson's thriller those butts aside it is still a pretty good camera so should you a definitely go out and buy it b really consider buying it c uh set it aside as an option or d completely ignore it and never buy it ever i would go with a b really consider buying it yeah you know like go to your local your favorite electronics dealer see it test it out a little bit probably take a few snaps because if you're looking for a capable compact tiny form camera this m50 might just be the perfect choice for you it takes great video and great photos as well but anyway on that note it is time to end i have been your friend your homie charlie karomi and if you mash that subscribe button at the bottom of this video i will see you again next week ciao oh shoot forgot my camera bye